It's almost time to say farewell to the first dogs, Sonny and Bo. But just as with past presidential pets, Americans are likely to remember them fondly for a long time. So let's take a look back at past presidential pets. Since 1789, the president and their families have welcomed over 300 pets to the White House. President Johnson's favorite pet was Yuki, a terrier mix. In private, LBJ said, you know, there is no one in the world I would rather sleep with than Yuki. George W. once remarked that his Scottish terrier, Barney, never discussed politics and was always a faithful friend. While the majority of White House pets have been of the dog, cat, and horse variety, there have been some notable exceptions. Calvin Coolidge and his wife Grace house more than 30 animals, including Rebecca the raccoon, Ebenezer the donkey, Smokey the bobcat, an antelope, wallaby, and even a pygmy hippo. At the turn of the century, Theodore Roosevelt is said to have kept over 50 pets, including Rollo, a St. Bernard, Josiah the badger, flying squirrels, a lion, hyena, coyote, five bears, a zebra, a barn owl, and even a one-legged rooster. Only three presidents have been pet-free, Millard Fillmore, Franklin Pierce, and Chester A. Arthur. Sonny and Bo's time in the White House may be coming to an end, but the history of its presidential pets lives on. Woo-hoo! <laughs>